and stop seeking being productive seek happiness because then you'll be productive <laughs>
but come on how cute is this a white vlogging camera in love so i've wanted this for a while just never had the like balls to buy it because if you keep being scared of spending money you're gonna lose all the opportunities to make more money like that's just is what it is okay if you sit on large amounts of money for a long period of time all you're doing is sitting on it you have to decide where it makes the most sense to invest. And I highly recommend don't just invest in products, invest in stocks. I got the Sony ZV-1. Um, it was released in 2020, spring of 2020. And then, or was it December of 2021? I don't know. It was released very recently, spring of 2020. And um, sold out everywhere. You cannot get this on Amazon. You can't get this on Sony. It's sold out i don't remember why i think it was due to something like they were saying it was due to the the memory like some sort of some i think some piece in this camera they could not recreate due to the pandemic and they couldn't get it the part from china so they discontinued the camera so i was freaking out trying to find it and i found it on walmart so it was like extra 200 bucks on walmart.com but it also comes with this really cool windbreaker thing that i thought was really nice i'm going to be vlogging oh yeah i'm going to miami for my birthday so i thought this would be really great to have on hand in terms of that super exciting stuff you know just to have the windbreaker there <gasps> Yes, this is really what I wanted. Just a white camera. Because even in public with a white camera, it's like so different to me. Like, this is so unique. All right, let's put the battery in. Okay, this is without any settings. This is just my first recording. And yeah, let me know what you guys think of the quality. I'm kind of like sneaking to look at myself in the viewfinder and I look like a an angel. Now I know why people have the VZ1. Oh my God, it looks so cool. <laughs> just in comparison, like they're both great cameras, but this one is just, this is next level YouTuber. Okay, period. done in terms of moving everything around i did make a few candles earlier because it's my day off and i can make candles during the daytime <laughs> i'm enjoying that i mean i probably could make candles during the daytime um normal days that work from home but honestly in sales when you're working from home you kind of just staring at your computer just trying to make something shake so <laughs> because i'll be trying to make something shake i don't be doing stuff for my small business but maybe i could i don't know but yeah look how much cleaner it is that is so amazing if you if you find something that you're good at that comes easy 
definitely do it. Like in terms of crystal candles, it just came easily. Like it did, was no question about it. It wasn't something where I couldn't, I was confused. It just flowed, like it felt natural. So find something that feels natural to you and, and earn profit on it. Main thing I wanna just drive in on is like in your candle business, if you don't feel like this is your passion, don't do it because there'll be thousands of times you wanna quit. So many times when I'm driving to the mall, I'm like, why am I doing this? But then, you know, you get the you get the payment for your work and you're like, oh, that's why I'm doing it. And <laughs> stuff so like my house has been a mess, but it's because I have a goal in mind of teaching y'all how to boss up. Is it me? Am I the drama? I don't think I'm the drama. <laughs> this and you know something. Sometimes people put ice in their um, wine, and I thought that was ghetto before, but you only live once. So I'm about to put some ice in my wine and light a candle. So yeah, period. period. This is a whole vibe enjoy the live go back and watch it if you are watching this go back and watch the live Can I tell you 
What's up? It is Tuesday. I feel amazing. I've just realized it's Easter weekend. You know what that means? We have two days off, Friday and Monday. <laughs> what we do it? Because I already took off last Thursday, Friday, and Monday. I feel like God is doing this on purpose. It's like, okay, you need to rest. You need to get your life together, girl. Get your life. So that's what I'm trying to do. So <laughs> in terms of that, the main th thing though. And stop seeking being productive seek happiness because then you'll be productive get this baby in here this is fresh <laughs> oh I want to use my new camera, so I'm going to see if I can do that. It's charging. This is the weirdest vibe. I usually just use a, a wireless charger, but okay. So let's see if we can do that. And when I'm watching YouTubers, my favorite thing is to see the camera different. So I'm going to show you. This is me with the G7X, and then you'll see me with the ZV1. We are on the ZV1. I have not set up anything, you know, in terms of like, it settings and none of that got set up but uh, so cool so i'll just set you guys down here i do have an unboxing to do i have five minutes before a meeting so it just occurred to me maybe you should not do this oh i can record at the same time so you can see side by side let me know what you think which one's better i also ordered a wide lens for the g7x i mean the zv1 because i wanted to have a wider lens i bet the audio is really good because there's a windbreaker on the sony zv1 um i can clearly see that my pigment is more pigmented on the sony vz1 than it is on the g7x i look a little grease I look a little grease and this is, that's so cool wow let's see what the natural light will do okay it's the middle of the day guys and I work from home so often when you're working from home you sort of get into your head and you get in a funk so I want to get out of a funk and I thought what better way to do that than to actually go and um <laughs> drop off the boxes because I have not dropped them off I packed orders last night it's like two I have a meeting at three hmm I should be fine <laughs> let's do it anyway sorry it's my first day back and I'm like off thrown off I feel like 
corporate America kind of throws me off. And then like when I'm not working, I'm kind of at balance. I highly recommend if you have a job, any of y'all take a day off, take a day off, see how you feel. And then when you get back, see what you feel and really, really hone in on the contrast there and understand more about how you can, what's it called? Um, you can center yourself to be, um, to feel the same in any, in any room, because often I have folk, I like to focus in on problems. Oh, I should probably stop talking. I'll talk to you. I'm going to get in the car. <laughs> we are in the car and I've learned something else that I'm excited to share with you guys. So I have been struggling with my ego. My ego is the word for it. Uh, pride in terms of like struggling with fear of being wrong okay but being wrong doesn't make you less of a person it doesn't make you stupid being wrong <clears throat> means that you didn't know something so or that you made a mistake so you don't have to be perfect to be I guess smart <laughs> And I just learned that today. I feel like every time I work a job, I learn stuff like this about myself. Cause if not, if if I didn't, um, if I never worked for anybody, I would just be in my own bubble of what I think is right and never get better. So honestly, that's something that I agree with, but I would never like let them know this. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> something, I almost hit this track trailer. But um, something I agree with, but my pride won't let me say it. Like, I just really want to release the fear of being disrespected by being wrong. You know? Because it really got me in trouble working at, um, in hotel sales. Like, but then again, you should never base any new scenario on previous learning and I have learned so many things that I've held on to that I want to release all right y'all we finna get the wagon out but I was just thinking like what is it what do we gain from being uncomfortable what do we gain from having anxiety like where in stress or anxiousness do we win you know you don't win sh you literally just got all riled up hyped up for what for what what did you get from it always have your business cards because you never know if anybody will buy from you but yeah i really do think what do you benefit what do you benefit from worrying nothing you get no money from worrying you get no opportunities from worrying and honestly i'm a i'm a selfish person so being more in tune with that really leads you in the right direction like what's in it for me not shit you know <laughs> being scared what's in it for me nothing also this is so cute so much easier oh thank you so much I should have looked <laughs> thank you Priority and expression of service, 
all the supplies are free. Oh, okay. So come in and I'll give you the cake, John. Thank you. You okay, babe? Yeah, I'm okay. Thank you. You're welcome. What about you, ma'am? You good? You look like you're a professional. You got the question and everything. Thank you. <laughs> Like a copper pterodactyl, pepper, chopper bite down like an apple. Match with the acres with the horses in the cabin. Like the narco, narco, got dope like Pablo. Pablo, cut dope like Pablo. Cut dope, chop trees with the Draco. Draco, on the north, got Diego. Diego. Say, I still a wiggle. No way. We'll be in rapping kilo. Yeah. Snub nose with potato. Using, and um, I also, what other co common challenges have you been seeing so far? Often I see that, um... I love helping you guys. It's so fun. Honestly, my fave. So it's later Tuesday. I changed clothes. <laughs> I now know why my house gets destroyed. I'm really buff right now. As you guys can see. But, I mean, this is fitting you, girl. It's, it's doing what it's supposed to do. Yeah, so let's open this baby up. I got so much stuff. I'm so excited to share this huge box of stuff. Um, gently to reuse this bubble wrap. <laughs> like a commercial or show, but guys, okay, so I'm doing something completely new. Instead of using these here, I'm going to be using these. So this is uh, this is the lid for them, but we'll get into it. This is a wooden lid from General Wax Candle Company. As you all saw in my unboxing video, I went through in detail all their amazing products, and they sent me these in exchange for that video. So just with that, I also create mini candles in these. So I bought some tea light wicks. For that um just because or they gave them to me just because i was trying to get my card up to a certain amount and yeah so here are all the lids super cute <laughs> this is so cool and then the first scent i got is inviting vanilla never smelled this before oh my god it smells so good so it smells more like an ice cream vanilla. Oh my God. Wow. I'm so excited. What the heck? Like this is genuine excitement. Like what the heck? I was worried because the other fragrances they sent me to feature weren't my faves. But this is so good. Y'all should definitely try out this inviting vanilla. Oh my God. This is amazing. 10 out of 10 inviting vanilla. Oh. <laughs> then I also got cashmere cocoa ultra so as you all know I have a satin sheet mini here that I used cocoa butter cashmere with and I ran out and they sent me uh, cashmere cocoa just for reference so here okay that's more chocolatey like it's more cocoa than yeah I don't really like this I'll probably give this away. I'll do a giveaway. Huh. Yeah, I'll give you, I'll give away the cashmere cocoa. Don't like it. Comment if you want it. I'll give it away. Then I got these beautiful matte white or frosted white vessels here. I was freaking out, but I have fragrance oil on my hand. That's the only reason why it's looking like that. That's fragrance oil. That's not like uh, broken glass. I was freaking out. But yeah, this is the concept for the Dream Collection now. To be in this white rather than in the um, tin. So we're going here. Because this is a very... This is a bougie uh, collection. If we're going to go hard, you're going to go hard. So yeah, now I got these new vessels in love. And so many packing peanuts. I just ran out of packing peanuts. Oh my God, this is such a great day. Wow, so exciting. So yeah, I think 
that's all that's in this box. Okay, I like it in the G7X too, but honestly, the Sony VZ1 had your girl crisp, 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 but yeah, period poo, period poo, okay, period. Hope this can help you guys, but you should only have emotions based upon good things. You can never have emotions based upon negative things because you have no control over negative things. Even if you had decided to make a mistake, I mean, it's literally destined for you to learn from it. So you only can have positive emotions. Y'all, I don't know why I never did this. But I'm about to do something. So crazy. And you guys are going to be like, girl, you crazy. Or maybe you won't be like, girl, you crazy. But girl, you been crazy. And it's good you wise enough. <laughs> it's in September. It's when is it? What's today? It's it's April. <laughs> Never done this. So I'm about to have my clear quartz. I'm gonna let it charge. The wind doesn't blow it away. Oh my god, I love this. Okay. Amazing. Okay, I guess I could just work right here. Wow, this is lit. Never done this before. I'm pretty sure, I'm like 75.55% sure that a bee just flew in my house. I left it open. Yeah, I did. I don't know, I was enjoying like being out here in the nature. <laughs> Y'all, I am such a city city girl because <laughs> I don't I don't like nature and things. So I'm not like a city girl in the other aspect of it, but yeah, I don't really like nature, so this is new for me. I need to close that so that the bees won't get in. I can't believe I've never sat out here and did work. I usually just sit in my office and in my in my brain and overthinking, which is a crime. The people who like me will like this vlog. Not the people who are so focused on candles. We'll talk about candles later, but I just wanted to share a peek into my remote life. What I be doing. It's the first for me. I need to decorate out here. I've never decorated anything. So I'm gonna try. Yeah, so the camera died. So now we're back on the G7X. I'm happy we're doing this because then I can get your comments down below about which camera has better quality. So yeah, comment which one you think is better. I have just been really enjoying using both, but yeah. Okay, so first thing I got was an additional wide angle lens for my ZV-1 because often I am creating videos on YouTube uh, regarding my process and sometimes this G7X is designed for vlogging. It's not really designed for like what I do in terms of process. So I got an extra additional lens for my G7, uh, my ZV-1. And it's white because I wanted a white camera, y'all. can see. Adorable. Yeah, yeah. What I wanted to share with you guys is something super exciting. So I've been using these iridescent auras. Mm, this smells good. This is a cashmere vanilla. Yeah, I gotta design it and put it in restock. But um, what I've been noticing is that I've seen these beautiful TikToks of people pouring this beautiful glittery wax. And it just looks so beautiful when it's burning everything. And I'm just like, why not? You know, why not add in crushed crystals? So 
amazing. This is a great selling point in terms of having crystal candles with crushed crystals infused in the wax so it melts. This is a vibe. Your girl is just thinking. Like, I mean, it's so crazy because I just saw a cuss, I saw a, um, can't want to do the candle business review. Someone had done these. Someone had done crushed crystal in her candles. Um, but my deepest fear is that I'll do it and it, and it takes away from the hot throw. So I'm definitely going to have to test this out um, and just, I'm going to research. This is what you do when you try something new. Um, research the heck out of it before you even do it, okay? Because what's going to happen is you're going to get started. And if you start off wrong, that's how it's just going to go for all of it. You just keep messing up. It's just like when you have really an IKEA project and you don't read the instructions. If you mess up that one screw and you build the whole thing, they got to undo everything and go read the instructions, you know? So YouTube, highly recommend. That's why I created a YouTube channel because it's for real people with answers and real people are watching it. So just literally search everything that you need on YouTube. Everything you need is on YouTube or Google or in a book, but YouTube is easier for my attention span. So yeah, I'm gonna research this guys. We're gonna be making candles with crushed crystals. I need to buy some clothes. Either that or go in my garage and get all of my clothes. All of my clothes from moving in September are still in my garage. So we're in my garage. Period, poo. Here. All of my clothes are in there. So if you see me, oh wait, huh? that looks easily accessible. I might just, <laughs> but yeah, I'm watching my camera reviews. I'm like, oh, that's the same pink hoodie. That's the same pink hoodie. Oh, that's the, that's the same pink hoodie again. Oh Lord, that's the same shirt. That's the same shirt. I wore the same clothes and I have so many clothes, but I just be wearing the same. What do you be doing? Just doing things with the candles. But yeah, you guys, my wax from Hive and Honey is out for delivery. It's not here yet. Oh, but it's so warm and beautiful. But yeah, my wax from Hive and Honey is out for delivery. So as soon as that gets in, it could either be here today or tomorrow. But even without it, we could still make a candle because my focus is just to try out this crushed crystals and see if i still get a hot throw with it because if not we ain't doing that i don't care what it looks like i care what it smells like so if it don't smell right we're gonna keep the regular wax you know what i mean but yeah i feel so amazing today i'm about to buy a computer you know i use a macbook air but a macbook air does not do what i need it to do regarding uploading because i upload so many videos oh yeah by the way if you haven't seen already i activated the membership feature on my channel yes so that's where i'm going to go in detail regarding exclusive videos exclusive one-on-one -on -one coaching while i'm still creating my website and giving you guys a chance to ask me any questions you want and we'll walk through what the best next steps are to expand your business so yeah that's a lot of stairs but yeah main focus here is i have another meeting at four it's 3 35 now so after that meeting i'm gonna film another candle business review and then um work on candle maker survival guide all night so yeah stay tuned i just want to say i hope you can't see your reflection because i'm totally naked but i just want to say this this new Sony VZ1 with the mic is so loud. Of the fact that you should just put your business name, you know? Put your business name here so that we can start there. Um, professional, it's giving professional quality. That's the goal, quality. Okay, my camera's super far away. Okay. My wax is here, guys. hey guys what's up oh my god it is friday i feel amazing i'm still trying to 
get used to this camera. I realized something. I never open up my blinds and just have complete natural light. So I'm gonna try that. My makes you hat on. That's what someone just ordered. Don't worry, I'll wait. Put in the comments. Put in the comments what you guess someone just ordered. Maple chai and sweet cream. No surprise there. Take this overboard now. I want to be feel that heat. And we can arrive the book and share that heat of love. I want to ride. The glitter it looks so pretty it really makes me want to keep the glitter but it just has to have a hot throw i can't play games with glitter without i put a very little bit in there and it oh my god i went crazy so very excited about this um new glitter inclusion if it goes well i'll definitely include the glitter in the crystal candles because can you imagine being going to the crystal store and buying a candle which you spent 38 dollars on because people my jesus okay so the mall the store is on the second floor of the mall people are walking past yankee candle coming to the crystal store and buying my candles for 38 dollars. that's crazy so my idea is to even enhance it even more and have like the the crystals um in the so when they light it and they'll see like glitter, they'll probably die. Like I think people will love that, especially online as well in terms of TikToks. The best way to like explain your business is to go viral on TikTok. I haven't done it yet, <laughs> but when I do, I'm gonna do it. Y'all, I just need to move that table. I got the plan. So we're gonna move the, the work table. Y'all can see that. Yeah, we're gonna move this table over here and then put this table over here because there's a window here and you know the best videos on social media are the ones where it's the sunset. <laughs> okay guys, that was hard. I forgot that three wick candles um, are huge and this one's actually bigger than my um, 
my zentin the diameter is like roughly five centimeters rather than four so these little chip clips don't work and so then my old method of using skewers and clothespins, I was like, oh, let's go back to that. And I don't have any more skewers, so I had to use two thermometers. <laughs> Show me you finesse. Um, you are creative without showing me, without telling me you creative. <laughs> this is perfect scenario for that. <laughs> when I tell you, your girl got creative. Like, I was like, okay, period. All right, okay, I see what I'm up against. Um... So I put a vessel here to keep the weight of the thermometer there while it's curing. And then this one's good, uh, just in terms of me switching up the like direction of it. But as you can see, all the wicks are straight, except this one's a little curvy curve. A little bit, okay, not straight. All the wicks are straight. Oh, the clothespin just fell into the... Y'all stand by. Okay, back to that. Um, we're clearly going to have to do a heat gun to that part where all the uh, clothespin just gave it a little. But we might not. We'll, we'll see as this goes on. As you can see, it's cured incredibly fast. But let me tell you, I don't know about the hot throw, but inviting vanilla, it smells so damn good. Like, it just smells... It smells better than my honey vanilla. It smells better than anything I've ever smelled. Like, it smells like you was baking sugar cookies. Uh, ooh, it smells good. I've never smelled that before beyond, you know, going to either, I guess, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Ross, you know, and those impulse items while you're in line. You'll, you tend to smell like, I don't know, good candles in the corners and things of that nature. So, yeah. That's all that I thought I ever, ever existed. I never knew there was a fragrance vendor, candle supply vendor, that had a vanilla like that. And it's good. Like, because you know vanilla is the hardest thing to get right as a candle maker. Because candles with vanilla in it are faint, quiet, dead. This smells so good. And did y'all see the pour? Oh my god. It was a perfect pour. So, I did roughly about... Um, 20 ounces of fragrance 20 ounces of wax and two ounces of fragrance oil so i wanted to share that in case you buy these 22 ounce vessels from them um honestly they say do 12 percent of fragrance oil but i did about like 11 percent because i don't know i don't like to do 12 it seems like too much but we'll see what this hot throw is like on this candle they recommend the htp 62s Okay, I just feel like comments like this, it's like sent from God. Last night I was thinking, why, like, I should stop doing this. This is stupid. I'm not making as much money as I'm making in my 9 to 5. But then it's like stuff like this <laughs> really keeps me going. So thank you, Diamond, so much for your comment. It's super motivating. But yeah, let's pack this order. Let's go.
and I never been embraced. And the money's hard to make, so I bet they on their face right now. When he tell the story, that's not how I went. Know they be lying a hundred percent. Moved out of the risk and forgot about that bit. Why they just call me to tell me come get it? Now that boy off and I don't want no credit. If it was me, they wouldn't regret it. Let me be dead and now they won't get it. Heart is still beating, my niggas still eat it. That girl they look like the garden they eat it. Tell those hoes better for spilling the tea. And they shawty came back and said she didn't mean it. It's hard to believe it. I know that they had the crib gone crazy down there. What they had didn't last. Hey guys, okay, so it's Saturday, uh, 11.54. I'm trying to be quick because you know UPS, USPS closes at noon, but then they give you like 30 minutes of access to the self-serve, so I'm trying to go now. And like my car has been so weird. Like it's a push start, but it's been asking me to put a key into like this secret location. Should I just roll with it? But okay, 69 degrees. And I'm wearing like this big hoodie. Whatever. It's always winter to me. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, I feel amazing. New camera, who this? <laughs> New camera, who this? I feel like I have a fat face right now. So I just need to diet. Like, stop eating food. They still have a line. So we're here, guys. Um, they still have a line. The sad thing is, like, they close the door, so it's like they, they can't leave until their line's done. But yeah, let's go in here and drop this off. I also have some letters that I need to send out. So. I've had a lot of Canadian contacts, so I keep saying out. <laughs> Like out, you know, or sorry, like how they say. So yeah. Okay. It's so my camera's like so bulky right now. Hold on, let's see if I can lock the door. Okay. It's nice to be right. Siri's talking to me, by the way. All of one package. This shit. Ah, <laughs> oh, so bright today. Wearing so much clothes. I'm gonna drop something. Something. It was cold at my house. <laughs>
You go, go. Um, excuse me? Are you do you work here? Do you have a pen? I don't think I got anything. And we did. Okay. Talk about it when we get to the car. Hey guys. So I went back in to drop off some letters. And I was like, I'm going to leave my camera in the car. And then I was like, okay. I put the postage on my letters, dropped my letters. And I was like, why not check the P.O. box? And I'm so glad I did because we got another package from Raw Indulgence, Raw Rev, shoprawrev.com. So this sounds really legit. So super excited to review this. Not exactly sure what it is. Um, I always get like excited about stuff like this because it could be from a brand. Um, even if it's not a brand, it could be from one of my subscribers, and it means the world to me that you guys take the time out of your day to literally send me stuff, you know? I just feel blessed to have that. So, yeah, definitely looking forward to reviewing that. Um, this is the end of the vlog. I feel like I keep ending the vlog in my car now. I can't stop. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. Definitely subscribe if you haven't already. We're on our way to 20K. We're almost at 17K. I can't believe I'm saying this out loud. <laughs> but yeah, this is so exciting. So yeah, guys, just stay tuned for next week. It'll be a lot more videos in line with our specific needs in terms of starting a business and where you can buy supplies and then business um, marketing ideas. I'm doing a TikTok challenge where I'm going to post once a day on TikTok and see how that goes. <laughs> see if I can expand my business so that you all could do the same thing. But yeah, if you did enjoy it, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. Uh, comment below what you thought. And then, you know, just watch all my videos. Support your girl. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the rest of your day, your week. Happy Easter. I hope you enjoy your next hour. Just living your purpose. Love you.